Millions of Facebook users are now eligible to receive some money. Some money. The social media company just settled a massive class action lawsuit. Fox 10's Ella McNamara is here now to explain how you can claim your money. Guys, so it is a $725 million settlement. That sounds like a lot, right? But this is for anyone who had a Facebook account from May of 2007 to December of 2022. That would make you eligible. So all of that money does have to be divided up quite a bit. That's why we're saying probably just a little bit of money coming your way. Now this lawsuit all came about in 2018 when Facebook disclosed that the information of 87 million users had been improperly shared with a company and that company was called Cambridge Analytica. Cambridge Analytica is a political consulting company used by the political campaigns in the past of Donald Trump and Ted Cruz as well as other campaigns. And we don't know at this point how much people will get paid in this class action settlement because payments will depend on how many people submit claims and also how long each user maintained a Facebook account. So if you want your share, whatever it ends up being, you do have until August 25th to enter a claim. And this website right here is where you would enter your information. So what you do is you just put in your name here your address, some more details kind of about your account. And then at the very, very bottom, if I can get there, there is some information about the bank account. So you could maybe submit either your bank account information, your Venmo account, your Zelle information to enter here on this website. And then when those payments do get out, you will get paid whatever that is. Uh, we're gonna put this website on our website, box10phoenix.com, so you have all the information. Facebook also has it up as well. So again, just do that. Takes a little bit of legwork. Uh, it's not a scam though, and uh, you will have a little bit of money coming your way towards the end of the year if this does apply to you. Ellen McNamara, Fox 10 News. Thanks.